Hello guys, this is John Martin UK and welcome to another food review Yay! video. Today we're going to cook some jam roly-poly from Aunt Bessie's and some to go with it we're going to cook some instant custard. So the roly poly is in the oven, it's just about cooked. So now we've just boiled the kettle. So let's uh, make this instant custard. Basically all you've got to do is boil a kettle with boiling water, tear open this packet, put it in um, a jug. We've got a jug here. There we go. We'll read the instructions on the back. If you're a novice like me, it says... Where are we? Oh, here we go. Empty the contents into a measuring cup. Make up to 425 millimeters, milliliters with boiling water. Mix thoroughly with a fork until smooth. So if you, if you want it a bit thicker, you use less water. I normally use about 400. So let's do that then. And then we're get the roly-poly out and mix it all together and start eating it give it a review there we go look at that look at that lovely roly-poly oh yes I can't wait to eat it it smells delicious right let's put some boiling water on this um, custard 400 millilitres I think that's about 400 isn't it there we go so we start stirring it with a fork and a spoon shouldn't take long so you just stir it keep stirring it it's a bit lumpy and horrible it looks very horrible at first but once you uh, once you mix it for a minute it's uh, it's fine it starts getting thicker and thicker I mean already it's starting to get thick now sometimes I use a spoon instead of a fork We'll get a we'll get a spoon here. There we go. So I just keep whisk stirring it and whisking it or whatever you want to call it. Make sure all the powders are not stuck to the bottom of the um, the jug. Still a little bit thin, isn't it? It's not too bad. Try not to spill it, because you can't stir it too fast, otherwise it goes everywhere, doesn't it? So as you can see, it's gone down to about 350 now, where I've stirred it. So it said 425, so I've used less, I've used less uh, to make the custard thicker. I think that's sort of alright, so what we do then, we get this roly poly out the pack. I'll try and do it with my hand here, it's probably boiling hot, I'll have to be careful here. So we leave the custard till last. Let's get this roly poly out. I might have to put my. Uh... Don't know how I'm going to do this, guys, I'll have to try and do it like that. Right, I'll hold it like that and I'll uh, try and show you me getting it out the pack. So it's all stuck to the cardboard. Probably overcooked it slightly. It said 30, 40 minutes. It was probably in there 40, 45 minutes. So there you go, look. Let's tip it in the uh, bowl then. Should all come out now. Whee, there we go. So it's quite hot. Mmm, tastes nice. 
taste that jam. It's upside down, isn't it? Right, let's turn it over. <laughs> it's a bit mutilated, there you go. So it's out of the packet. There we go. So there's not much left in there, is there? Right, there we go. So that looks nice, it smells nice. Let's get the old custard on it. Pour the custard on it. Mmm, yummy, yummy. Look at that. Oh, I can't wait to eat this. There's a bit of spare custard over. We'll come back and eat that in a minute. Right, so there we go. It's ready to eat. So we're we'll going to sit down now. Give it a review. Right, guys. So this is the moment we've all been waiting for, to eat this roly-poly. Aunt Bessie's roly-poly. Look at that, with some custard. As the custard on it. Right, let's have a mouthful then. Oh yeah, cool, yeah, that's nice. This is delicious. I haven't had, I haven't had a roly-poly for about three, four years. It's not, it's not a pudding I buy very often. So I thought this is a little treat for John, or Johnny. <laughs> Johnny Vlogger or John Martin UK, there you go. Little treat for me. Mmm. Oh, look at that jam on the spoon there. Oh, I've just had that. That is, oh. Look at this. It's a bit hard, the pastry, because it probably slightly overcooked it in the oven, but um, I'm battling away to eat it. Ah. Mmm. Oh. Oh. Wow, what can I say? That is just amazing. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put it down. I'm going to point the camera down while I'm taking mouthfuls. And then you can see me eating it. Right, here we go then. Mm. Oh, this is amazing. It's crunchy, it's tasty. You can taste the jam, the pastry. The custard blends in well with it. I must admit, it's a bit harder than I thought it would be though, the pastry. Maybe because I slightly overcooked it. But this is, um, this has got to be one of my favourite puddings. There's a couple of others I like. Others I like are um, apple crumble, spotted dick, cornflake tart, which you used to have in school years ago, and um, chocolate pudding, chocolate, chocolate sponge and chocolate custard. And strawberry ghetto maybe, strawberry ghetto with custard or something or cream that's nice but anyway we're eating roly-poly for now so I've eaten nearly half of it so that's half gone there there's a few bits left and got the other half here so um we might have to get some more custard I've got some spare custard in the kitchen If I had to give this 
a score right now. The score for the Rowley Poly would be I'd give that I'd give it a nine because I would have liked this to have been soft. I've slightly overcooked it. But apart from that, I can't knock it. And the custard the custard is um nice as well. It's not too watery, it's not too thick, there's no horrible skin. So a nine for the roly poly. The custard I'll give that about give it about an eight. Eight out of ten. And then I suppose if I had to give it an overall score, an overall score for this, I'd give it a 9.5. Because it's very enjoyable. Tasty. I haven't had this for a long time. And it's one of my favourites. So, 9.5. There you go. So, if you like this video, click the thumbs up. The like button. And click that subscribe button. Johnny Vlogger UK. Or, if you're watching this on my other channel, it's John Martin UK. I have two channels, so the video is probably on both, or one of them. So I always promote both channels, John, Johnny Vlogger UK or John Martin UK. John Martin UK is my new one, so if you haven't subscribed to one or the other, please subscribe to both. It would be much appreciated. And um, don't forget to click the notification bell for all future video releases and lives. So I'll see you again soon. And I'll... Finish off this delicious roly poly. Bye for now. I've got hiccups now. <laughs> Bye.